Thank you so much for joining the prayer this afternoon. I want you to tell me what your name is and where you're joining from. And if you can help me share to your friends, that would be a great idea today. Tell me where you're joining the prayers from today. Tell me where you're joining the prayers from today. Write in the comment section, Grace, Grace, this is my story. Grace, Grace, this is my story. Grace, Grace, this is my story. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Oh, praise God. Um, you know, grace, grace, this is my story. Grace, grace, this is my story. Welcome, Pastor Sergi. It's nice to see you there. Pastor G, it's nice to see you there. Um, can you hear me well, loud? Phenom, it's nice to see you. Yeah, grace, grace, this is my story. Pastor Maya, it's nice to see you. Grace, grace, this is my story. I know you can hear me from Abuja. Welcome from London. Okwe Ariya from London. Welcome. Welcome in Jesus' mighty name. All of you on Facebook, I want to write Grace, Grace, this is my story on YouTube, whatever you're watching from. Grace, Grace, this is my story. NLP this morning was phenomenal. NLP this morning was phenomenal. We had this testimony of this lady that had um, a condition. We prayed in the UK. The power of God came upon her. Instantly, things began to drop off her body to the glory of the Lord. Why, there is nice to see you. Grace, 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 this is your story. One of the things we're going to start with today is a place of thanksgiving. We're going to start from a place of thanksgiving. We're going to start from a place of thanksgiving. And in case you don't know this, throughout this month, 21 days, 21 days, we will be spending time thanking God. We will be spending time thanking God. Because I believe that you are just one step away from your breakthrough. And thanksgiving is going to bring a completion in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Glory to God. This is what we're going to thank God for today. Lord, thank you for being my shepherd. The Bible says he is a good shepherd. Lord, thank you for being my shepherd. Glory to God. Lord, thank you for being my shepherd. My God. <laughs> Father, thank you for being my shepherd. Lord, thank you for being my shepherd. Psalm 23 says, the Lord is my shepherd and I shall not want. Lord, thank you for being my shepherd. You are the one that guides me. You are the one that leads me. You are the one that directs me. Lord, thank you for being my shepherd. Father, thank you. Father, thank you for being my shepherd. Lord, thank you for being my shepherd. You're always taking care of me. You're guiding me. You're protecting me. You're shielding me. Father, thank you for being my shepherd. Father, thank you for being my shepherd. Father, thank you for being my shepherd. In Jesus' name name we're praying in jesus name we're praying this is what the bible says the bible says what, what, the, the, there's a very powerful scripture but before i read that i want to show you something i want to read something to you on that point of thanksgiving a songwriter wrote a song i said dependable that's who you are this is the second point of thanksgiving father thank you for being dependable oh my god lord thank you for being dependable what am i dependable i, I can look back and point that God came through. Father, thank you for showing people that you are dependable with my life. Father, thank you for showing me that you are dependable. Showing me that you are dependable in my life. Let's go ahead and bless us all in name. Father, thank you for showing me that you are dependable. Father, thank you for showing me that you are dependable. Father, thank you for showing me that you are dependable. Father, thank you. you. You did not put me to shame. Father, you did not put me to shame. You didn't ask, you didn't allow people to ask me, where is my God? Father, thank you for showing me that you are dependable. The God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob, the one that's never failed before. Father, thank you for showing me your dependable. Father, thank you for showing me you are dependable. Father, thank you for showing me that you are dependable. 
Father, thank you for showing me that you are dependable. Lord, thank you for showing me that you are dependable. Oh, glory to God. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name. I want us to read the scripture together. Oh, shaliga barata namata kabaya kataya. Isaiah chapter 38 verse 14. Isaiah chapter 38 verse 14. Hallelujah. Another point of thanksgiving. Father, thank you because my prayer point have become testimonies. I don't know if you believe that with me. Father, thank you because my prayer point have become testimonies. Oh God. I want us to thank God. Father, thank you because my prayer point have become testimonies. Father, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Those that pray for marriages, it has become a testimony. They're getting engaged. They're getting married. Those that pray for approvals, the approvals have come. The evils have come. Father, those that pray for funding, the funding has released. Those that have been seeking for children, now they are pregnant. Father, thank you for the prayer point points are becoming testimonies. I give you praise, oh God. I give you praise, oh God. Lord, I give you praise for the prayer point of becoming testimony. To the doer of all things, I bless you. Father, we give you praise. In Jesus' name we're praying. In Jesus' name we're praying. If you want to share the link with your friend, go ahead and share just before we Go ahead and share it. I want to read to you from Isaiah. Glory to God. If you want to share the link, go ahead and share it. Let them know that we're praying today. We're praying right now. Father, thank you for letting me know that you are dependable. Lord, I'm grateful. I'm grateful. I'm grateful. Father, thank you for prayer points have become testimonies. In the name of the Lord, I thank you for that. That prayer points have become testimonies. In Jesus' name we pray. Isaiah chapter 38 verse 14. Asa Oh, this scripture is very, very powerful. Isaiah, Isaiah chapter 38 verse 14. It says, like a crane or a swan or swallow, did I chatter. I did mourn as a dove. My eyes filled looking upward. Oh Lord, I am oppressed. Undertake for me. My emphasis is this. He says, oh Lord, I am oppressed. Undertake for me. Undertake for me. What does undertake for me? Oh God, take it over. This place where I don't have a say, take it over. Lord, undertake for me. It's a prayer you're going to pray. Father, where, my, where I need help, but I do not have natural help, Lord, undertake for me. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, let the support of God be strong this month. Let the support of God be strong this month. Lord, undertake for me. Let the support of God be strong. Lord, undertake for me. Let me sin banatata, a benekus de vava, a beneskus elevetos, a beneskotalebasa. In Jesus' name we pray. I'm praying for you. Oh, Mashataya, Lord on Ayaka Bayana Mashata. What a powerful scripture. See what it says here. See what it says here. This is very powerful. He says, Lord, I am oppressed. Undertake for me. Lord, I have no say. Be my say. Lord, I am oppressed. Undertake for me. I'm praying for you today in the name that is above every other name. That when you have no voice, the Lord will undertake for you. That the support of God will be strong on your life. The support of God will be strong in your business. It will be strong. That in the name of the Lord Jesus, in the name of the Lord Jesus, the support of God will be strong and mighty. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Everyone that is tough, the power of God is building you out. Everyone that is stuck, the power of God is building you out. Everyone that is stuck, the power of God is building you out. You will no longer be stranded. You will no longer have to say, where is my God? The power of God is building you out because the Lord is undertaking for you. The Lord is undertaking for you. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, everyone that is looking for funding for school, everyone that is looking for capital for business, you are believing God for a child, you are believing to get married. The Lord is undertaking for you. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the Lord is supporting you. When there has been no men's support when men have disappointed you my father that is rich in mercy the bible says in Ephesians 2 he said god is rich in mercy that richness of his mercy will extend towards you receive the richness of god's mercy i don't know if you can hear me 
a picture that says God who is rich in mercy. I'm praying for you, receive the richness of God's mercy. I said, receive the richness of God's mercy. Take no matter what you cannot do by yourself, receive the richness of God's mercy. Receive the support of God from heaven. Receive the richness of God's mercy. Everyone that has a goal, everyone that has a dream that is stalling, receive the richness of God's mercy. Receive the richness of God's mercy. Receive the richness of God. Everyone that men have told you that is impossible, receive the richness of God's mercy. Receive the richness of God's mercy in the name of the Lord Jesus. So, Second Kings chapter 6, verse 5. Hallelujah. I've received the riches of God's mercy. I don't know if I've received it. I declare with my mouth, I've received the richness of God's mercy in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I have received the richness of God's mercy. Mascote Lima Kenaskele Matando Lorobakate Gentata. I have received the richness of God's mercy. I have received the richness of God's mercy in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Second Kings chapter 6, verse 5. The Bible says this. The Bible says this. And one, but as one was falling the beam, the axe head fell into the earth, and it cried, Alas, master, for it is borrowed. This is my prayer for you. The Bible says, as they were in the middle of a, of a breakthrough, something went wrong. This is my prayer for you, that from this hour, nothing will go wrong in the process of your breakthrough. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, you will not experience problems and sin again. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, things will no longer fall from your hands. I, I pray for you today that things will no longer fall from your hands. I, I pray for you today that things will no longer fall from your hands. I, I pray for you that things will no longer fall from your hands. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, glory to God. We're still praying from that verse. We're still praying for that verse. And, and, and the verse says this. Oh, glory to God. The Bible says, it says, where did the act head fall? You are going to begin to declare. This year, there will not be aborted testimonies. There will not be halfway testimonies. In this month, this month of May, it will be complete victories. I don't know what God has started, but the Bible says that faithful is it has begun it, it will also finish it. I declare that you are having total and complete testimonies. In the name of Jesus Christ, type in the comment section, I receive total testimonies. I receive total testimonies. I receive total testimonies. I receive total testimonies in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, glory to God. Oh, glory to God. Glory to God. There's a prayer I prayed for. You know, we're, we're, we're praying. And there's a prayer I began to pray for our partners in NLP London. And I would love to share the prayer with you. All of you and partners in up in London, you're going to get a video from me. I, I hope that you're a partner already. Deuteronomy chapter 30. Hallelujah. Deuteronomy chapter 30. Oh, glory to God. In verse 9. I, I, I just want to extend the prayer to you. The Bible says in Deuteronomy chapter 30 verse 9. You can let me type in the comment section. It says this. This is what the Bible says. It says, the Lord will make you plenteous in every walk. Oh, my God. I don't know if you can hear this. I don't know if you feel it in my spirit. He said, the Lord will make you plenteous. He says, he will make you plenteous in every work of your hands. Either you're a creative person, or you do a blue-collar job, or you do a white-collar job. This is the promise of God to you. Deuteronomy chapter 30 verse 9. He says, the Lord will make you plenteous in the works of your hand. Hallelujah. I prophesy that in the works of your hands, there will not, it will not be scarce. It will be plenty in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord will make you plenteous in the work of your hand. In the fruit of your body, in the fruit of your cattle, in the fruit of your land, for good. This is what I'm going to. He says, and the Lord again will rejoice over thee for good. That's the prayer today. My prayer for you is that, I'm not I, you need to catch this. He said, the Lord will rejoice over you for good. I'm declaring that this month of faith, the Lord will rejoice over you for good. The Lord will rejoice over you for good. I want you to make it a prayer that this month, the Lord will rejoice over me for good. This month, the Lord will rejoice over me for good. Go ahead and pray. According to Deuteronomy chapter 30 verse 9, I declare that this month, the Lord will rejoice over me for good. 
and then the bridge of Rakapana, yeah, the Lord will rejoice over me for good. Go ahead and declare right now, the Lord will rejoice over me for good. He will rejoice over your progress in your career. He will rejoice over your marriage. He will rejoice over your engagement. He will rejoice over your healing. He will rejoice over your miracles. In the name of the Lord Jesus, the Lord will rejoice over you for good. I declare this month of May, it will be total victory. The Lord will rejoice over you for good. It will rejoice over you for good. I, I prophesy this to you today. Receive in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord will rejoice about me for good. And the last prayer point is very simple. Let the anointing intensify for my life. Uh, that there are some things I that there are some things I want, but there's nothing greater than the power of God and the presence of the Holy Ghost. Uh, uh, not cut, uh, Lord, let the anointing intensify over my life. Uh, I've seen dimensions, but I want deeper dimensions. Uh, uh, Lord, let the anointing intensify over my life. Pardon me if I pray like crazy, but I need it. Uh, Lord, let your anointing intensify over my life. Uh, Lord, let your anointing intensify over my life. Life. The oil was not be still. Lord, let your anointing intensify over my life. Jane Korate, Jane Kaprate, Jane Kaprato, Jake, 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 Nembra, Shambra, Koma, Brate, next Kramana. Let your anointing intensify over my life. Oh my God. Thank you. Oh my Shantala Barabaya. Le Bono Murobatane Manakabaya Kataya. Le Boramana Katala Rabba Shantala Rabahaya. Apashka pala braha to kabaya bana mataya. Et mano korash elementola rabahaya. El le kosh te braka bala to raba samba la manehi. El le kutmene sheve le bonta haya. Hallelujah. Father, thank you because your anointing is intensifying on my life. In the name of the Lord Jesus, in the name of the Lord Jesus, in the name of the Lord Jesus. I give you praise and glory, O oh God. I give you praise and glory. I honor your holy name, O oh God, for answer. Go ahead and thank him, everyone. Go ahead and thank you because you rejoice over me. Hallelujah. This month of May, you rejoice. This month of June, you rejoice over me. This month of June, you rejoice over me. This month of you rejoice over me, man. Sonte legema nambrante kabrasko bara manate javara kataya e jolo manakataya. We give you praise and glory, O oh God. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen and amen. I, I, I wanted to take time. I want to take some time, and um, you know, I, I want to suggest to you go back and read the scripture, Deuteronomy chapter thirty, verse nine. It said, "You'll be plenteous and cattle in the works of your hand." That means if you're a contractor, you should not be scarce. Whatever you do, he said, it's not the scarcity to be plenty. He said, the Lord will rejoice over you for good. And that's a prayer. This month of June, he will rejoice over you for good. We're going to hear testimonies for you for good. In Jesus' mighty name, Father, thank you once more. I want us to pray for NLP London. We're praying. You know, this morning, I was praying for NLP the UK. And I was saying, Father, we believe you for 3,000 miracles. And God says, why are you saying 3,000? Believe me for more miracles than people need because I can do more than enough. I'm praying, that, I'm praying for NLP London that everyone that has medical challenge that steps in here will be healed instantly i'm praying i'm praying that everyone that has immigration issues to be dissolved instantly i'm praying that people that have marital setback financial setback it's a result by the power of the holy ghost in the name of the lord jesus christ that the power of god will move in a mighty way that the whole of the uk have never seen or experienced before we well, thank you for this in jesus mighty name we pray amen amen thank you for joining the prayers today just 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 for you to know if you have not registered for NLP UK, you need to register. It's really, it's significant because what the Lord has told and shown us is mind-blowing. It, it will be a meeting that will change the whole and the trajectory of the UK forever. If you have someone in the UK, send the link to them to come for the conference. July the 1st, the link is in my bio. The second thing is this. I want to invite you to join us in church this Sunday. I'm starting a new teaching called Satan Get Lost. It's a teaching on the believer's authority. Maybe you are struggling from demonic affliction, some attack. It's time for Satan to get lost. Amen and amen. Thank you. Our, our 21 days of Thanksgiving continues. You'll be in touch today. If you don't follow me, just press the follow button and follow on this platform. Thank you. God bless you and have a wonderful day.